Hey, how's it going? This is going to be my no-nonsense guide to getting 120 hertz working on the Oculus Quest 2 right now, along with how to get the Oculus Quest 2 version 28 update if you don't have it already. Let's jump right into it. First things first, head over to this Reddit page, which is the Oculus version 28 mega thread, link in the description. You will see that the top post pinned comment will be a download to version 28. What you're going to want to do is download version 28, and in the link in the description, there's another guide that tells you how to sideload the app how to sideload the update to your quest 2 so just do follow that guide if you don't have the update already uh, if you already have the update now we're gonna get into how to activate 120 Hertz first of all make sure you have side quest installed and your quest 2 connected to your PC and also make sure you have 120 Hertz enabled in the experimental settings tab if it's not there you can restart your quest 2 and it should appear there and if not you're gonna have to wait until you get the update so what we're going to want to do, this works with ADB of course as well, is click run ADB commands and custom command. The first command you're going to want to type in is ADB shell settings put global 120Hz underscore global 1. Uh, in the description you can copy and paste all these commands, make sure you do them in order. Next command you're going to want to run is ADB shell settings put global 120Hz global 1 without an underscore. And the final command you're going to want to run before being able to use 120Hz on PC with Link on anything that can run it, assuming your Quest 2 is actually able to run it in certain games, um, you're going to want to type in ADB shell set prop debug.oculus.refreshrate120. Make sure you run all these commands in order. Then press the power button once on your Quest 2 to make it go to sleep mode, then press it again to take it out of sleep mode, and then it should be in 120Hz mode. And you're good to go. Just like that, you'll be able to run at 120 hertz, even though the Oculus app will still say 90 hertz, and it should also say USB 3 connection recommended, even though you're on a USB 3. I'm assuming it's just a glitch. Uh, this is what's happening for me, but if I booted up Beat Saber, for example, it would run at 120 hertz, even though it says it's only running at 90.